<laughs> what is up, guys? It's your boy Reed Kenneth, Flash King Comics, and today we are talking about DC's New Age of Heroes, the new Challengers. Yeah, this is issue one, and this story is so epic, guys. It's so mysterious. You know, if you want something new, a different taste than what you've been getting from DC, uh, this is totally new, and uh, you don't have to know what's going on. There's, I, I want to say, there's not a really good, uh, a lot of, you know. I guess it's like a rewrite of something else, but, you know, it's, it's new, so you don't need to know the point of that. You know, if you want to find out the history, you can go find out from somebody else. I'm pretty sure they got an explainer on it. But, uh, yeah, you can jump right into this with, uh, you know, new fresh taste buds and just get an uh, enjoyment of what Scott Snyder and Aaron Galipsy are uh, giving you. And the uh, artist is Andy Kerbert, and, yeah, it's really good, guys. So... Show you a couple issue pages real quick. We got Hawkman coming out. So, you find out that this guy uh, in a mummy outfit, um, you don't really get to see his face. So if you look, if you get the cover, you know, pay attention to this. You get to see his face. His brains are kind of showing right here, and his eyes are the big, are the big key. But, yeah, he's in this mummy outfit, and, you know, he's headed towards Challenger's Mountain, and it's rainstorm and it's thunder and everything like that, and the pilot's like, look, I don't think we're going to make it, we're going to turn around. He's like, look, if you're not willing to go, then I will. Tosses him out the window, it's the first death scene, and all you see him going to the mountain with this rock fragment that's pulsating, and you're like, what is going on? On that note... You see these uh, unlikely candidates all, uh, they're all coming into this portal room and all they remember is their last moments of dying and now that they are waking up they have this like tattooed on their arm of like an hourglass. And this guy Prof walks in right whenever they all, you know, there's four candidates, right whenever they all come in he comes in and he's like no, you're dead. It wasn't a joke. Um, call this borrowed time, if you will, for, um, you know, helping complete this new thing, which is like this new death-defying adventure, uh, where they challenge into the unknown, or, you know, explore into the unknown, should you say. And, yeah, it's, it's very exciting, you know, uh, he's like, look, you don't have to do what I say, you can leave right now, you know, be my guest, but if you leave you will cease to exist and your life will be over just like it was a couple of minutes ago and yeah it is hilarious because this one guy let's go through these characters real quick trina alvarez is the only person you actually get a backstory on her you find out like the justice league was fighting these alien uh that was like coming through the sky and one crashes in her lab she's trying to help somebody and yeah uh that's her last moments of her death so you know, um, this next guy is Robert Brink, you have Moses Barber, and then Crunk. And, uh, you know, Robert Brink is like the first one's like, no, nah, I'm out of here. And he's like, good, all right, go. And as soon as he leaves, he dies in an instant, and they all watch. And he's like, yep, that's your example. I wasn't lying to you. And, uh, you know, he's like, "Say, call him scare tactics if you will, you know, but yeah, point blank. Welcome um bethany hopkins and we have a new character a new female character that comes uh in and it's just like what the hell is going on and it's very exciting you know he's like as soon as that uh you know hourglass on your arm that's what it is you know goes out you know you're you're done it's the it's the next people that come in you know so that's exactly what happens they die new people come in and that's the way that it's been going um, hopefully we'll find out more about that because there's been generations and generations of people that have died, come and helped for a little bit, you know, put in their, you know, experience or whatever, uh, should you say on the, uh, the pro the overall project. And you're like, what is this project? Like, what is, what have they discovered? You know, what is this guy, you know, not telling us? And, you know, the first mission that they have to do is they got to go find this rock fragment somewhere on the edge of the world. And it's just like, it's exciting, it's new, and it's very epic. Um, on that note, he he himself uh, is, you know, overall watching everything. 
And he's talking to AI, and AI's like, look, they're probably going to die. And he's like, no, that's why I picked them, for the reason is they're probably going to stay, stay alive, survive, because that's what they've been doing their whole life. And the AI is like, yeah, that's probably true, but then they're going to be harder to control. And he's like, look, it's your job to ask the questions, but don't worry about that. I got this under control. I already know what's going on. And he's like, I'll figure it out. This is the end game, and we need, you know, unconventional, you know, ways of winning this. And, yeah, it's, it's very exciting. It's very new. And on that end note, all you see is this skeleton figure in the background. And it's like, what the hell is going on? It's just so much mystery. It's so new. It's so igniting. It's so exciting. It's the first issue. So... If you don't get it for the puzzle piece, at least get it for the story. I mean, it's really good. Um, or if you don't get it for the story, at least get it for the puzzle piece. Because, yeah, it's really good. And, you know, I didn't expect this, but I'm actually missing a staple in my comic. Like, a very top one. There's just, there's no holes or nothing. It's just they forgot a staple. You know, it's stapled in the middle. There's one, two, but there's not one in the, uh, in the top holding the story to the actual cover. So, it's funny. But yeah, this is your boy Rikin at Flash King Comics, and this has been the new challenge for the new Age of Heroes. I'm out.